For those of you who have never been to Happy Ending before, in addition to reading original work, the authors are required to do something on stage they've never done before. They have to take a risk, or I call the cops. Nell Zink was born in California in 1964 and currently lives in Germany. Who is talking? <laughs> That's the way to end talking. I'm really proud and excited to give you Nell Zink. The happy ending format has this uh, special thing where I'm supposed to, to take a risk or do something I haven't done before. So I thought, the risk I'm going to take, I have here 50 euros in cash. And I'm going to give this to whoever promises that they will donate most of it. They don't have to say how much to the Chevra La Haganatateva, to the SPNI. So who's, who's an honest person who knows how to donate to the SPNI? I want to dance my two-step dance Everyone knows we don't fall when we dance alone I'll take the lead and when I look away I'll be that shy gorgeous girl for me to steal Born in Ramat Gan in 1967, Edgar Carrot is the most popular writer among Israel's young generation and has also received international acclaim. It is my great pleasure to give you Edgar Carrot. <laughs> Usually I don't like to read when uh, people that I know are in the audience. But what I'm going to do is actually I'm going to read my wife's favorite story, which I always avoid reading on stage when she's here because it's a story about her, which some say does not present her in a very positive light. <laughs> and the light in my house falls perfectly without her having to turn on even, <laughs> okay, a single spot. Right naturally, the way you always do. She says she's a songbird. I translate to my son with impeccable naturalness. She says she's a red-feathered songbird who flew here from a faraway land. Anthony Mara is the New York Times best-selling author of A Constellation of Vital Phenomena, winner of the National Book Critics Circle inaugural John Leonard Prize, and the czar of Love and Techno, a finalist for the National Book Critics Circle Award in Fiction. So I, I had a, an entirely different, um, um, much more elaborate risk planned out, but then last weekend I visited, uh, I visited my parents. And my mom informed me that she had found a uh, notebook full of love poems from 1996. They say you gotta get ahead in life, but what's this race? Who are we racing? What's this race? What's the haste? Why the corporate greed? Instead of money, let's make the love people really need. The next author of the night uh, is Colin McCann. He is the author of six novels and three collections of stories. Born and raised in Dublin, Ireland, he has been the recipient of many international honors, including the National Book Award, the International Dublin Impact Prize. I'm going to invite my good friend, Lila Azam Zangene, to come on stage with me and tell me when to drink. I think you want to drink. I do want to drink. I, know, I, know. I can tell. <laughs> okay, cheers. Lahaim. Lechaim. My risk is a simple one, but uh, a considerable one for me, uh, because something happened and my books were never shipped here uh, from, from the UK. So instead of reading an, exer an excerpt from my first book, um, I will read uh, the first page of my new book, which I've never read to anyone. One fabled night. Black was the Sabbath moon they'd come to see. The night around them lay immense, and in the winter sky there barely burnt a star at all. She doesn't 